Welcome to MLB The Show in this presentation of Minor League Baseball. We've got baseball on the 4th of July between the Sacramento River Cats and the Fresno Grizzlies. Here comes perhaps the fastest man in baseball as Billy Hamilton strides forward to get this ball game underway. Late on that one as it's fouled off to the left side. The 2 2 one more time. Rolled slowly down the first baseline. But this is going to be a foul ball as that keeps things at 2 and 2. Weather not much of an issue tonight. A mild 65 degrees here at game time. Locked in a good battle. Here comes another one. Count remains 2 and 2. Hit hard to the right. Foul. The 2 2. You can certainly tell at bats like this one, frustrate the heck out of a pitcher. But you got to find a way to stay composed and execute your plan. Fielded cleanly, and there's one gone to start the night. Coming to the plate now, Jalen Miller. He went deep last night twice. Bouncer up the middle, scooped up, and there's out number two. So bases are empty here with two gone, and moving into the batter's box next will be Yomer Sanchez. The 1 1 is looked at off the plate for a ball. Now a check swing, but he does manage to hold up in time. Ball three. The 3-1. Three Takes a strike for a full count now. Three and two. Clearly wasn't ready for the fastball because it was pretty much center cut, and he couldn't pull the trigger. Might have been looking for another curve. Once again, a 3-2. Hit hard on the ground to first. Oh, and he whips on it at first. It's right by him into right. Batting four. The left fielder. Number 83. Into the box. Chris Shaw. That's lifted the other way out to left. Williamson's under it. And that's the third out. Late Jake Knoll. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. The one two. To first. And a good throw gets him one gone. Now with the plate, Adrian Sanchez. Second baseman. Adrian Sanchez. The one one. That's a ball. Count three and one. And he missed with that one. It's ball four. A one out walk here in the home first. Here's the catcher, Wellington Castillo. First shot for him here with a runner at first now and one away. And it's fouled away. Sanchez, base runner at first with one out. And this one's in the dirt, but it won't skip away far enough for the runner to advance. Working for the punch out and the offering. Not a bad time right here to put that runner in motion. 3-2 count. You send the runner, and if it's a bad pitch, it's ball four. And he got him. Next will be the cleanup hitter, Luis Garcia. He takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. 
One ball and two strikes to count. Here's the one and two delivery. And he fouls this one off. The one two is put in play to the right side of the infield. He's got to hurry. Throw won't get him. Now in the box, Yadiel Hernandez. A couple of hits for him in four trips to the plate last night. Now ball and two strikes now. He appears to be having some issues with pitch command to start the game. He's dealing with two guys on, and that last pitch looked like a big mistake in that location right down the middle. And the throw is in time to get him to retire the side. Stepping in, Jalen Davis. He went deep in the contest last night. Into the windup, here's the two and one pitch. Oh, that's out. Come on, I'm watching you. And that misses for ball four, so it's a leadoff walk here to start the second. Now at the plate, Zach Green comes off an 0 for 4 in last night's ball game. Here's the 2 2. Hit in the air out to center field. Center fielder on the run. He's there and records the first down. So stepping in, Gerard Daniels. First swings for him in this one with a runner still at first and one gone. Change up. Good pitch there. One and two. Well hit the other way, and it's into the gap. The run comes across to score, and they jump ahead one nothing. Batting it. The catcher, Joey Bart. Into the box now, Joey Bart. Good change of speeds, but he lays off two and one. Hit to first. And he'll take this one to the bag for the out, but meanwhile, the runner will move up 90 feet to third base. So a man at third here with two gone, and that'll bring up the pitcher, Andrew Suarez. The set and the 1 1. High in the air out to center field. Banks is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the side. half of the second set to go and here comes the first baseman Aldrim Corridor and this is low ball two two and one to two and two now line but speared on a hop and there's one down now. Standing in, Mac Williamson, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. The 1-1. One, one. Taken, strike two. One ball, two strikes. Now a fastball, but that's easy to lay off, and it's back to even at two and two. Breaking ball well inside and taken for ball three. One of the things you want to do with a starter, get that pitch count up. Here's another productive at bat as this count now gets to three balls and two strikes. And he will make the play out there, and there are two away now. Striding into the box, Nick Banks. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Bases are empty here with two men out. 
And this one's up around the eyes, two and one. I don't blame him for not coming over the heart of the plate. He circled this guy on the lineup card when he got to the yard today. He's been swinging one of the hotter bats in the game. Got him swinging, and that will end the inning. Top of the third set to get underway, and at the plate will be the speedy outfielder, Billy Hamilton. Full count here. Here comes the pitch. And this is popped up near second base. Barehanded at his knees. It's in time. And what a vital play there, preventing the leadoff man from getting aboard. And he's a little too high with that one. Two balls and a strike. Changes up on him, but that's in the dirt for a ball. One out, nobody on. Grounder hit hard down the first baseline. But this will wind up foul as he runs the count full now. Still hanging with him. Another good swing to keep it going. The next 3-2. Locks him up for strike three. So bases are empty here with two gone. And moving into the batter's box next will be Yomer Sanchez. Yomer Sanchez. Weak grounder down the line at third. Hit on the ground to third. And there's a base hit as that gets through into left. Now that is number 83. Standing in now, Chris Shaw. <laughs> Clearly off with his timing on that one, a swinging strike. Now a curveball misses inside. Good spot for an RBI. Put the ball in play with the runner in motion. He could score all the way from first. Ready to deliver the full count pitch. Got him swinging as he runs the fastball by him to end the inning. Leading off the inning, Will Crow, as they'll look to get something going here and even this game up. Come back with one in the dirt as the count moves to two and one now. Fastball and mm, looks like they're pinching him a bit here. It's three and one. One thing that can nag at you as a pitcher is having to work really hard to get a guy that you think you should be able to cruise right through. He's not known for his offensive prowess, but he's putting together a real nice at bat here. The third baseman. Stepping in, Jake Knoll. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. And that catches the high outside corner, 1 and 2 now. And when a guy starts leaving the curveball up, that's a sign he's beginning to tire a little bit out there. He's got to be able to get on top of that pitch or he's going to start getting hurt. The 1 2. Skied into straightaway right. Long run for the right fielder. He's got it. A nice play there. Two away. Now Riding in once again, Adrian base. Sanchez. Adrian. He drew a base on balls his first time up. Little tardy on that swing as it's well wide at first. The one and two pitch. Waved at and missed for the third out. Not much of a chance at hitting that one, and the inning is over. All set for the start of the fourth. And next, it'll be the outfielder, Jalen Davis. Right side hit hard. And that is through into right field for a single. To the plate Green. now, Zach Green hit the target, but this is low, two and one. Hit down the third baseline. 
but this will wind up a foul ball. Two and two. Yanked on the ground down the line, but a foul ball as it holds it two and two. Yeah, you could tell he was ready for another fastball, but the pitcher went to breaking ball, and the hitter just fouls that one off. Nobody out, runner on first. Swung on in the dirt, and that's a strikeout. Digging in for his second at-bat, Gerard Daniels. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at-bat with another big hit right here. Well, he got a good pitch to hit last time up. Looked for it up in the zone and didn't miss it. Those are the pitches you only get maybe once an A-B, maybe once a game, maybe once a week. So he certainly capitalized on it last time. To second for one. On to first as they get the double play to get him out of the inning. Leading off the inning, Wellington Castillo. And they'll need him to get something going here. Now the 2-1 pitch. Will not catch the zone. Ball three. It gets down, and that'll be extra bases on their first hit of the game. Throw into second. And he's going to make it there, barely, as he's into second base with a double. Caleb Barriger, a southpaw standing six foot three, gets the ball now out of the bullpen. So now to the plate, Luis Garcia. Here's a high pop up. Sanchez is there for it. One down. Stepping into the box, Yadiel Hernandez, as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. The one two. This is on the ground over to first. He's got it, and he'll take this one to the bag for the out, but meanwhile, the runner will move up 90 feet to third base. Into the box now, Aldrin Corridor, as he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third. The 1-1. One, one. That's a tough curveball right there to stay into as a lefty hitter. That ball looks like it's almost going to hit you, and it breaks over the inside half of the plate. And that misses two and two. Got him. Lively fastball that time, and it puts an end to the inning. All set for the start of the inning, and next to hit is the catcher, Joey Bart. Now the three and two pitch. Hit high and deep out to left center field. A ball that's carrying, but he can't get it as it's off the wall. And he is in the second base with a leadoff double. The back, the pitcher, Caleb Barriger. At the plate now, Caleb Barriger. And now a bunt attempt here as he gets this one down. And that's the first down. So it's back to the top of the order now. And in to hit next, the speedy presence of Billy Hamilton. Good idea with the change, but it's two and one. And it's two balls and two strikes now. One out and a runner on second base. Great change up there in the dirt for the third strike. And he makes the throw to first. Hamilton is retired. Two down now. Digging in once again, Jalen Miller. It was a backwards K, a strikeout looking for him in his last at bat. Yeah, Maddie, and hopefully he got it out of his system. Especially now, he's got to bear down. He gets the two strikes in this spot, has to put the ball in play. Looking to keep this a one run game, the pitch. Now a ball lying towards center field. That's in there, base hit. 
And the run is in to score from second. It's a 2 0 ball game. The batter number two. Second base. Into the box. Yomer Sanchez. Sanchez. In there. Now the throw. Way late, and he's in there easily at second. Still one and two. He's ready. Now the pitch. Runner in scoring position at second with two down. That's lifted the other way out to left. Williamson's under it, and that's the third out. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Mac Williamson. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Things not looking very good so far in this one, but we're still in the middle innings. They're down by a couple of runs, and this would be the right place and the right time to get something going. The last thing they want to do is to try to come from behind and win this one in the eighth or ninth inning. Digging in, Nick Banks. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Yeah, but it was a good changeup, Matty. Good arm action on that pitch. Look for him to try and stay back a little bit more. Let the ball get a little deeper. Don't be shocked if this pitcher tries to rush a heater right here. There's ball four. Trace Barrera will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. Your Grizzlies, number 73. Barrera. High in the air and drifting out to shallow center. Sanchez ranging into the outfield. He can't get there as it falls in. And there are two away now. Now at the plate, Jake Knoll. He flew out in his last at bat. A 1 1 is in there for the second strike. Two balls and two strikes now. Two out with the man at first. Grounder down the line at third. Oh, and he can't come up with it. Now back. The second baseman, Adrian. Into the box now, Adrian Sanchez. In the dirt here. And a nice job to keep the runners at bay as the count moves to two and two. From the stretch. And a good fastball swung on and missed for strike three. And the inning is over. Yeah, Kyle Finnegan, Finnegan takes over to start the please. sixth inning on the mound. Number 67. Top Kyle. half of the sixth about to get started. And Kyle. next to bat will be the outfielder, Chris Shaw. Fouled off. Another payoff pitch. Lifted the other way down the left field line. And this will wind up a foul ball. Payoff pitch one more time. It's the top of the zone. He struck him out looking. Ready for another now shot back. now. Jalen Davis. Right Last time through was a base hit. David. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and it's one and two. Off the plate that time and a little high. It's even at two and two. Fastball well outside. Zach Green waits on deck. Count still full, three and two. You're lucky if you get one pitch a night right down the middle. Cannot be late on that fastball. 
swing and a little blooper to center. Garcia takes charge out there and he stays with it for the second out. Coming to the plate now, Zach Green. He's 0 for 2 thus far in this one. The 1 1. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Center fielder giving chase. He's there to make the play, and that'll retire the side. Stepping up now, Wellington Castillo. He's working on a one for two game so far. Now the one and one pitch is looked at for ball number two. A high fastball is in there. Hey, you want someone sometimes to rattle the bat rack, but also the guy on the mound's got to eat too. They're executing their pitches out there. It's going to be tough to score some runs. The 2 2 one more time. And in a two run game right here, you really don't want to walk the leadoff guy to start an inning. You've got to keep that tying run in the on deck circle as long as you can. And he takes strike three called on the fastball. One gone. Looked like ball four there, but instead it's three and two now. He was able to sneak that fastball by him on three and one, so, so now we've got a battle on our hands. And he takes ball four, so he's on, and as you know, that often means the steal could be in order here. Working for the punch out and the offering. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Hamilton is under it, and he brings it in for the second out of the inning. Digging in now, Aldrin Corridor. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. Runner on first with two away. There's a ball low. He misses with the changeup. There's a swing and a missile sent out to center field. Hamilton going back. Still going back. Leap, but he can't bring it back into the park. It's a home run. At the plate, Mac Williamson. High in the air out to center field. Hamilton is under it. He makes the play, and that'll end the inning. Now batting, Gerard Daniels. Ready to deal. Here's the 2 1. Line drive to left. And there's your go-ahead base runner right away as this is down for extra bases. Now batting the catcher, Joey Bart. Standing in now, Joey Bart. Swing and a ball lifted in the air toward the line and right. And that's going to fall for a base hit. And the runner from second is in to score. Abiatel Avellino come on to pinch hit now with a runner at first and nobody out. A runner at first with no outs here. Low with a fastball that time. Two balls and two strikes. Just a bit high with the fastball, but didn't get the call. When you're playing close games like this, base runners mean everything, so he can ill afford to start giving away free passes. And this is popped up near second base. Garcia is there, and he's got it for the first out. 
Billy Hamilton digging in now. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. And now this is popped up. Castillo should have room behind the plate. And he'll put this one away in foul territory for the second out. So coming to the plate, Jalen Miller, singled homer run in his last time up. Yeah, Matty, pressure's off right now. He extended his hitting streak that last plate appearance. Now he gets to get back into his zone, work on his craft, and try and drive something in the gap. Two and two. Swing and a miss as he chased with two strikes, and that will retire the side. Wendy Peralta gets the call from the pen to take over on the mound and start the home seven. Ready to go for the last half of the inning, and that'll bring up the outfielder, Nick Banks. This thing's far from over, even though we're moving into the back end of this game. Only down by one. All they need to do is get this leadoff guy, and they're an extra base hit away from tying this thing up. And he'll step on first for the out. Three unassisted. Brody Reed will pinch hit here, and he's the potential tying run. Reed. Two balls and a strike. To two and two now. Hey, I'd like to see a little bit more discipline than that. You get to count your favorite and swing at a pitch that bad? Not good. He's set. Here's the two two. Swing and a miss on the fastball that time. Out number two. Into the box. Jake Knoll is working on a one for three thus far. The 1-1. One, one. one pitch away from wrapping up a very good innings work out of the bullpen here. Here's the one and two. Still a ball and two strikes. Very tight ball game. Three to two our score in inning number seven. Heading out towards shallow right. Davis is there and he'll put it away to retire the side. Javi Guerra has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Ready to begin the eighth and moving into the batter's box next will be Yomer Sanchez. One and one here it comes. Right there at the belt, one and two now. Swung on in the dirt for the third strike. And he makes the throw to first. Sanchez is retired, and there's one away. Number 83. So now it'll be the four hole hitter, Chris Shaw. He was hunched out looking at strike three last time through. Yeah, always frustrating to go down looking. Everybody does it, though. You'll have a few ABs where you get completely fooled. Look for him to be on the attack early in the setback. The one two. Fouled away. Now here's the pitch. And they come inside with the fastball but it misses here and it's back to two and two. Fastball didn't miss by much and it's a full count now three and two. And a fastball misses there, ball four. Stepping up to the plate, Jalen Davis. A hit in two tries so far. The 3 1. Finds the zone to fill the count, three and two. I think it's a real possibility that they put that run on first in motion. That would help them stay out of that double play that would end the inning, but that's also kind of risky at the same time. One there, relay to first in time, and just like that, this side is retired. Jerry Blevins is on to pitch out of the bullpen in the bottom half of the eighth. Number 39. 
Gary so striding forward now Adrian Sanchez no hits to this point. There's a curveball but it misses well out of the zone. Levens has seen his role change with those one batter lefty specialists going the way of the dodo as a part of MLB's pace of play initiatives. The 2 2 pitch. Softly hit to the left side. And there's one away. So striding in, Wellington Castillo. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. Swing and a ball lifted into straightaway center. After it is Hamilton. He gets there, and that's the second out. Now with the plate, Luis Garcia. 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. Garcia. The 3-2 pitch. And he lays off ball four. So now the potential tying run here is aboard late in the game. Now to the plate, Yadiel Hernandez. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Runners on the move for second. Pitch misses low. The throw down. And it's far too late as he steals second with ease. Trying to hold the lead. Here's the delivery. Got a good spot to be in right now. Pitchers fall behind in the count with a guy up that hits really well with runners in scoring position. The three and one pitch. Grounded softly to the right. Reined in. And the off balance throw gets him as he takes away a hit and his side is retired. New inning set to get underway. And next to bat will be the first baseman, Zach Green. The 1 1. Drilled to the right side. And that is into right field. So the leadoff man's aboard here to kick off the ninth. The bat. The third baseman. So now to the plate, Gerard Daniels. Count moves to a ball and two strikes now. The one two he is swung on and missed. He got him. Digging in, Joey Bart. It was an RBI the single catch. for him in his last Joey. plate appearance. Whoa. Now the two one waves and misses for strike number two. One run game here in the top of the ninth. Looks at a fastball low here, and it's full three and two. Count remains full. Ready to deliver the full count pitch. Shoots this one over to first. And that'll get past his outstretched glove. It's a base hit. Fortunately for him, though, no error on the bobble, and the runners will hold it first and second now. Austin Slater will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Swung on and lifted in the air to left center. Williamson's under it. He's got it, and there are two down now. Big spot here. First and second. Two men gone. And in the hit next, the speedy presence of Billy Hamilton. Ready with the one-two. Now pitch runs in on him here, and all he can do is flare one foul off to the right side. Hot shot on the ground is short. Fielded cleanly. And the two-out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. Mick Vincent comes out of the bullpen to shut things down here in the ninth. Number 50. Nick. Striding in to start the ninth, Aldrin Corridor, as they'll look to get something going here and even this game up.
And that misses there, so he runs the count full now. Bounce to first. Throws in time, and that's out number one. And the versatile Mac Williamson hits next. He could really use a knock here 0 for 3 in the game so far. The 1-1 one, one home. Misses. Ball 2. And this ball's pretty well struck. High and deep to left field. That one is out of here. This game is tied. In now, Nick Banks. One and two now. Bases are empty, one man out. Off speed pitch in the dirt as he takes it for a ball. Had to sit back on the changeup, and he did a good job to get the bat on that one. The 2 2. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Hamilton is there, two gone. Jeremy De La Rosa will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. Number 22, Jeremy De La Rosa. All even now, two and two. Two and two. Here it is. Well, he really needs to make this guy swing the bat right here. He's not the type of hitter you want to dance around with. Payoff pitch on its way. This is line to left. And that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. So he wins the full count battle and finds a way to extend the inning. Stepping in now, Jake Knoll. Pitch out. Nothing doing. Possible winning run stands at first with two out here. Hit hard on the ground to third. Scooped up. And the throw to first is in time, but the damage has been done as the side is retired. Fernando Abad takes the mound as he'll be the first man to pitch here in extra innings. We are into extra innings and stepping up as the shortstop, Jalen Miller. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Hernandez has the best view of this one, so he'll take it for the first out. Digging in the switch hitter, Yomer Sanchez. On the night, he's two for four with a pair of singles. Now the one and one pitch. And he lays off. Ball four. Now the potential go-ahead run is on base here. Chris Shaw, the next to take a turn at the plate. There's one away. The runner at first represents the potential go-ahead score. Double play is in order, however. And he misses with it. Ball four. So the potential go-ahead run moves into scoring position now. Striding in, Jalen Davis. He's working on a one for three thus far. Now the 2-1. Hard hit toward the hole. And that's through into left, a base hit. Throw comes in quickly here, so that'll hold that go-ahead run at third now with still only one away. The first base, Zach Green. Into the box now, Zach Green. And a swing and a miss, he struck him out. And a big out there as the go-ahead run stays at third with two gone now. Two out, bases loaded. Daniel. 
No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. It often becomes harder to hit the zone when the pressure starts to heat up. And it's two balls and two strikes now. Boy, I love the way he's competing out there on the mound right now. He's got a chance to rack back-to-back K's with two runners in scoring position. He's not giving in at all. Hit on a line, and this one's into center field. That's a base hit, but it's offline. He scores, and they've jumped ahead here in the 10th. Oh, but it's offline, so the run will score. Austin Williams trots in from the bullpen the here ball. as he inherits a tough the spot ball. with two on and two Go away. Ball. Into the box, Joey Bart. And he lays off for a ball, two and one. Great chance right here as a hitter to be really aggressive. With two guys already on, pretty good shot. He's going to get a challenge pitch right here. On to first, and that'll do it as they manage to not and get out of hand. Tony Watson takes the ball, looking to make sure this game goes no further. Save situation here in inning number 10. Ready for the bottom of the 10th here, and set to go is the second baseman, Adrian Sanchez. And batting nine, number 82, Chadwick. Now the 2-1. Line drive to center field. Hamilton is there, and he has it for the first out. At the plate, Wellington Castillo. His previous battles with Tony Watson. He's a 333 hitter. Two of those hits were for home runs. Hit out towards second. Sanchez is up with it. And that's the second out. So here's the cleanup hitter, Luis Garcia. 0 for 2 for him to this point. Now the one and one pitch. Inside, ball two. Now a swing and a ground ball. This should do it. He's got it. On to first, and that'll be a bitter pill to swallow for this home crowd as the ball game is over. Hey, it took them an extra frame to do it, but hey, they're not going to complain as they lock up a nice road victory here in 10 innings. And this evening's contest comes to a close. 5-3 the final. Nick Vincent claims the win out of the pen, his first. Tony Watson records the save, his first of the year. So that's a wrap here tonight for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak. This is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, find us on Twitter at MLB The Show. Fans are final line score. First for the victorious Rivercats, five runs, 12 hits, no errors. They left 11 men on base. For the Grizzlies, three runs, five hits, no errors. They left seven men on base.